Hello, Lewis and family. This is Dan. Just going to take a quick walk around this 2014 uh, E Class that you're coming to get next week. I just figured uh, something to look at over the weekend uh, to get you excited about your new car. I uh, did walk around it again. I just had him just wipe off the uh, the car and uh, so I could get some shots of the paint and take a closer look at the paint so I could better describe uh, the car. And really, the description is that I can't find anything wrong with it, really. Uh, the car is in great condition, inside and out, no odor on the inside, really nice interior, new set of tires. And uh, with the Formatic and the, the equipment that this car has, the premium package, the sport package with the uh, technology and so forth navigation uh, it's uh, it's a good really nice car I love the color combination this this blue with the interior real pretty uh, the interior condition just to give you an idea the bolsters in really nice condition nowhere there or the landing area of the base of the seat and then the other thing that I look at on these cars is uh, People can scuff their, put their fingernails up on the steering wheels and, and uh, you know, hold on to the same spot over and over again and, and cause it to dry out. But there's none of that happening on this steering wheel. It's just in beautiful condition. No marks on the center console, no scratches on the, on the wood anywhere. There's no odor uh, in the car. The door panel's in great condition. There's no uh, wear or uh, any kind of scratches, scuffs or anything like that. On there, we've got the, um, the carpet in the rear compartment here, let me show you that. Here's your uh, carpeted mats. In good condition there. All the way around. And I'll quickly just show you under here. The spare the tools uh, and all the original stuff on the car. No, uh, no apologies on the car required. Very nice car. On the E-Class, uh, this car has the paddle shifters uh, on the steering column here. The plus and the minus. I'm not sure how much experience you've had with this particular model. If you've had one or have been behind the wheel of one of these cars yet, but. The car's got 32,594,000 miles on it, uh, and there's no lights or warning lights or any kind of issues to worry about in the car. By the way, we did put it through the shop, and we put the tires on it, checked the brakes, uh, checked uh, all the uh, servicing. It was just recently serviced at the Mercedes dealership with 29,000 miles on it, and they would have uh, done the, any work that it required. With 32,000 miles, really, it shouldn't require much, and it didn't. Uh, it was just time for some tires. Excuse me. Put the air conditioning down here. You can see the navigation. And then get some close ups here of the console condition. Uh, no ashes or ashtray or anything ever used for, the, for that. That's just a lot of cars come with the smoker package. And you've got the uh, all the original equipment here, adapters and so forth. We've got the books that came with the car and so forth. Inside, we keep them in a cabinet. I live here. So that's pretty much it. There's really not much to discuss about the car. I just wanted to show you uh, the car. There's no dirt on the visors anywhere. No, no marks on the door panel. Headliners in nice condition. So yeah, these are uh, Goodyear Eagle tires, so they're a good set of tires on a car. This car has the uh, touch technology, the premium one package. Driving lights in the front, LEDs. AMG Sport wheels on the car. And I guess that should wrap it up. Uh, if you have any questions or anything uh, between now and the time you come get it, 
uh, let me know. But I just wanted to put your mind at ease on how nice the car was. I know you're going to love it when you get here. All right. Thank you.